I would like to demonstrate a special orthopedic assessment test called Morton's test to assess a condition called Morton's neuroma. Morton's neuroma is an irritation inflammation of a nerve, a neuroma, and it's located between metatarsals. It could be between the first and second metatarsals, the second and third, the third and fourth, or the fourth and fifth. Because of the anatomy of the interdigital nerves here, most commonly Morton's neuroma occurs between the third and fourth metatarsals, between the metatarsals of the third and fourth toes. So if there's a nerve that's irritated here, it makes sense that we can physically stress it by compressing the metatarsals together. So I place one hand on the medial side of the first metatarsal of the big toe and the other hand on the lateral side of the fifth metatarsal of the little toe. And I just squeeze the metatarsals together, trying to place a compression force on the neuroma between the metatarsals. If the client has a reproduction of the characteristic pain in this area, that's a positive for Morton's test for Morton's neuroma. One note about this, it's very important when you squeeze that you don't simply round the foot out and increase the concavity of the transverse arch here. It's important that we actually squeeze the metatarsals together. That is Morton's test for Morton's neuroma. Let's now demonstrate Morton's test for Morton's neuroma with a plastic skeleton. Assuming that the nerve, that's the neuroma, the irritated inflamed nerve is located between the third and the fourth metatarsals, right about here where this wire little metal spring here is, I place one hand on the medial side of the first metatarsal, the other hand on the lateral side of the fifth metatarsal, and I compress the metatarsals together, trying to squeeze them together and further compress that nerve. If the client experiences the reproduction of their characteristic pain symptoms, that's a positive Morton's test for Morton's neuroma. When we do this, it's very important not to round the metatarsals around and increase the arch, but again, to compress the metatarsals straight into each other. Morton's test for Morton's neuroma. If you liked this video, know that it is part of our video streaming subscription service. Click the link below for more information and receive a free ebook when you sign up.